Hi, I'm Taryn Gibson, President of American Nurse. Today we're going to be talking about the use of the stethoscope. This is something that you see used on children all the way to the elderly. And the reason is because it magnifies the sound of the heart. And this particular one has a flat diaphragm, which we use for certain frequency noises in the chest. And the other one sometimes has a bell on it, which will show a different frequency. Now, these are the earpieces. And as you can see, they're anatomically designed to fit in the wearer's ear. They need to be cleaned after each use, particularly if different people are using the stethoscope, but even if you are the only person using the stethoscope. One of the other main uses of this stethoscope is to take a blood pressure and to measure how the heart is pumping against the arteries and how the arteries are pumping back against the heart. As you can see, the use of the stethoscope is many. Nurse Sally was using on Dr. Kufus checking the carotid artery to hear the blood flowing through, checking the heart sounds, the beats, the number of beats, the pulse and the heartbeat, and also the blood pressure on his arm. As they pump it up and then listen to it coming back down again, they find out both the high and the low number to see how much pressure there's coming from the heart against the arteries and how much the arteries are pushing back against the heart. I'm Karen White Gibson, Registered Nurse and Certified Case Manager. We've been talking about the many uses of the stethoscope for doctors and nurses, how they listen to your heart, listen to your blood pressure, and listen to your abdominal sounds.